Hello everyone, welcome to Wrath of Math. I'm your host, Sean E, and in today's video we're going to be answering the question, what is a greatest common factor? So the greatest common factor of any two numbers, a and b, is the number n, such that n is the largest number, so that n times some integer k equals a, and n times some integer l equals b. So that means we're looking for a number that goes evenly into A and goes evenly into B, um, the largest number that does that is what you're looking for when you're trying to find the greatest common factor. So let's just look at a quick example. Um, suppose we're looking at 18 and 24 and we want to find the greatest common factor, and I'll just write this in notation, the greatest common factor, GCF, of 18 and 24. Sorry, it's all spaced out. I didn't originally planned to put it in the parentheses. So what's the greatest common factor of 18 and 24? Is it 9? 9 goes into 18, but 9, because 9 times 2 equals 18, but 9 does not go into 24, so it can't be 9. What about 3? Well, 3 times 6 equals 18, so it goes into 18, and 3 times 8 equals 24, so it also goes into 24, but 3, oh, you can't see that, 3, 3 is less than 6, and 6 also goes into 18 and 24, because 6 times 3 equals 18, and 6 times 4 equals 24. Is there any other number that's bigger than 6 that goes into both 18 and 24? Well, no, there is not. So 6 is your greatest common factor. So the greatest common factor of 18 and 24 equals 6 because it's the largest number that when multiplied by another integer um, equals 18 and there's another integer you can multiply it by to get 24. It's the largest number that goes into both A and B, both 18 and 24 in this case. So I'll do another video on how to find the greatest common factor, but for now, I hope that explanation has helped. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments or want further clarification. I'll see you next time. Be sure to subscribe for the swankiest math videos on the internet. I can hear your voice from all the way up here. Won't you please come to me? You'll have it up here, dear. There's a light where I